Good morning, Acadiana. Watching the rains and also Tropical Storm Gordon forming this morning. We'll start out with the rains that we have to deal with right now, and we've got some moderate to heavy downpours over portions of uh, Vermilion Parish right on the Iberia Parish state line, even a bit of lightning and thunder to go along with it. And then farther inland, we've seen some rains now starting to move into Lafayette Parish, most of them just to the southwest of the city limits. But I do believe this will eventually move inland and probably move over parts of the Hub City as well. Heavier rains continue from Dusan to Rain and Crowley and then northward up to around Church Point, east or rather westward over to near the Jennings area. And we'll see more of that rain because of an upper level low that's going to be moving off toward the west. But the big buzz this morning is newly formed tropical storm Gordon. Gordon was upgraded from a potential tropical system around the 7 o'clock hour as it moves through the Florida Keys. Winds are currently at 45 miles per hour. A lot of heavy rain coming onto the coast of southeastern Florida, and this is going to quickly move over the Everglades and eventually reemerge out in the eastern part of the Gulf of Mexico. Now, the forecast track does bring it pretty close to home. In fact, maybe a landfall over southeastern Louisiana or coastal Mississippi, but it could go as far west as Morgan City or perhaps as far east as Pensacola. That's why we have tropical storm warnings that are posted from Morgan City all the way to the Florida Alabama state line. Potential for any storm. Storm surge or coastal flooding will probably be east of our area. Our primary threat will be breezy conditions on Wednesday, as well as some very heavy rain. Anywhere within this area where we're seeing the computer models could easily pick up over five inches of rain. So today would be a good day and tomorrow too. pick up things around the yard because of the breezy conditions and get yourself ready to be prepared for any type of flooding that may occur. Could see anywhere between five and maybe seven inches of rain throughout the period. So again, considerably less than what we would have seen uh, during Hurricane Harvey as well as uh, the flood of 2016, but definitely something to be prepared for. 85 year high with a good chance for rain today.